how do you update the firmware of the DJI Avada 2? To do that, you need to have your DJI Avada 2. Of course, you need to have your goggles. I'm using my goggle 3. And you need to have the Motion 3 controller or the controller you are using when you're flying. You also need to have a pretty well charged battery. Right now, my battery is charged halfway, so I think that that's gonna be fine. If it's not fully charged and you're out and about like this and you have your charger here, you can actually move charge over from lower charged batteries into the one that has most power inside. And if you don't know how to do that, check out that video. Well, I can link it with the card up here because that is really, really handy because it can give you more power in one battery. So you can get a little bit more flight time or you can use it to update the phone where if you don't have it charged enough. So to update, we need to turn on all the devices. Let's turn on the drone. Let's turn on the goggles. Let's turn on the Motion 3 controller. And then you also need to have a phone because you need to connect the phone to this system to be able to update. So the cord to connect this one is in here. This is a USB-C to USB-C cord because my iPhone has a USB-C port. Then I connect the other end of this cable into the goggles port. And then we're gonna use the phone. Then we're gonna go into the DJI Fly app. And in the DJI Fly app, that is the one that is actually gonna connect all of these together. So here we can see that we are now connected to the drone so we can see what the camera sees. If that is showing up, we just tap back. And then we have, yep, here we got it automatically. A new firmware is available. If that is not showing up, you can go into profile, you go to settings, and in settings you can check for firmware updates. Then you can also check for FlySafe database updates. And here it would take us a little while and then, yep, here we get it again that we have a new firmware available. So you either click update there or you're gonna click update here from this screen. A new firmware version is available for the DJI Avada 2 and this is 127 megabytes big. So I just click install and I was gonna download the firmware over the internet into my phone, into the Goro 3, and then it's gonna distribute that into these devices that needs to be updated. And here I can just tap more, and I can see more information about what's gonna happen with this latest update. And here we have the Goggles 3 update because at the top here, that is the Avada 2 update. So now we're just gonna let this firmware download, and whenever it's downloaded, I'm gonna show you how we actually update it. And now we can see that the firmware is downloaded and instead of downloading it says installing and it's important that you follow the recommendation. It says do not exit DJI Fly or disconnect the device so it's pretty self-explanatory. But don't do that because the update is just gonna fail. And while you are updating you're gonna have some beeps from the drone and the drone will most likely also restart at one point. And if we are looking inside this Google 3 while we are updating, it says updating. So it's not much to see there either. Now we are up to 92%. The drone has restarted two times. And now the drone is apparently restarting a third time. So now we have firmware update successful. Restart if device powers off automatically. And when this is done, we can just click OK and the drone is now updated. And the drone is even turned on. And if we now go into profiles, we go to settings and here we can check for firmware updates. Yes, your firmware is up to date. Here's one feature that I'm gonna enable, that is firmware auto download. It says here that when this option is enabled, firmware updates will be downloaded automatically over Wi-Fi. So whenever you are on Wi-Fi, the app itself, if you're using the app, will download the firmware inside the app and the phone, and then you can update when you are outside a Wi-Fi network. So now after the firmware is updated, then we can see each other in that playlist, because that is my DJI Avada 2 playlist. Thank you so much for watching, have a good one, bye.